one of the most frequent questions that we get asked is how many Botox units will I need? And while that varies a little bit from person to person, there are some standard doses that I know that if I give to a patient, I'll see great results. So typically the glabella is a very popular area to treat and most often I'll put 20 units to that area. Um, the crow's feet is another area that I have a lot of requests for. And I like to do 12 units on each side. Occasionally I may do a little bit less and that will vary from person to person. The forehead is a little bit different. I will often treat anywhere from eight to 20 units. And that's gonna depend on the surface area of an individual's forehead, because some people have smaller foreheads, some have larger. I'm also looking at the static lines that I see on the forehead and how strong the muscles are. But those are pretty good ranges as far as the three typical areas that we see. And then often I'll have patients ask for a little bit of a brow lift um, or they just feel heavy through that area. And often I'll do anywhere from one to three units for a brow lift. And then lip flip is another popular area and I often will treat four units to that area. So those are pretty basic um, general rule of thumb for most people, but I will vary it individually to your needs. We recently did a post on slimming the face, which was treating the masseter with Botox. That's another area that I get a lot of requests for, and that varies from individual to individual. I'll often start at 15 to 20 units per masseter and see if that's enough to make it so that you can't clench as hard and you don't um, have headaches when you wake up in the morning. Often though, I may need up to 30 units per side. Uh, another area that people will ask about is the neck or those platysmal bands. And those vary from person to person. Um, a good starting point is probably 15 to 20 units depending on how bad your platysmal bands are. I may go down a little bit and I may go up a little bit depending on the person.